and welcome to another Eunice MQL Minute. My name is John Wickerchess and I'm here with Eunice Larry Tilma. And what do you have for us today, Larry? Well, today, John, we're going to discuss our Unimax multi-viscosity or MV pumps, which is a replacement for our current red Eunice pump. John, today I've brought several examples of Eunice positive displacement pumps that we use in our systems. Let me show you. For those viewers not familiar with our pumps, let me briefly explain positive displacement. Think of a syringe used at the doctor's office. When the plunger goes down, a known amount of fluid is dispensed. This is much more accurate and repeatable than other methods of fluid metering because a consistent volume is dispensed each time. At Unist, we use a drop or 1 30th of a milliliter as the unit of measure on our pumps. We rate our pumps for their maximum output per stroke, but they can all be adjusted down to dispense much less than that. This literally gives us accuracy down to the fraction of a drop. Here we have our original Unimax positive displacement pumps. We have two types, our standard black pump, which is used on most systems, and our low viscosity or red pump. The black or standard pump can be used with vis fluids with a viscosity of 50 SUS and above. The red pump was designed for use with lower viscosity fluids, such as water, water-soluble coolants, vanishing oils, or alcohol. This pump design has been replaced by our new MV pump. Now Larry, you've explained how the Unis pumps have been tried and true over, over a long period of time. So why the new MV pumps? Oh, well, that's right, John. These pumps are reliable and have years of field proven performance. But we did find that when used to pump very low viscosity fluids, the red pump has a limited life. We knew we could do better, so we designed the new MV pump to give incredibly long life with very consistent fluid output. During the testing, we cycled the pumps over 30 million times before the fluid output began to decrease. 30 million cycles. That's amazing. It is. Can you tell us more about the MV pumps? You bet. The output of the standard MV pump is one drop or 1 30th of a milliliter at full stroke. The high output version of the MV pump dispenses two drops or double that amount. Well, that's good to know, Larry, but how, as the customer, how do I decide which pump to go with? That's a great question, John. I will answer it for two different cases. How do I know what to ask for if I'm ordering a new system? And what do I need to do if I am updating an existing system that has red pumps? First, let's look at a new system. If you're using a low viscosity fluid similar to water, water soluble coolant, vanishing oil, or, or alcohol, choose a one drop or two drop high output MV pump based on your fluid output needs. We found that in 90% of our systems, a one drop pump is usually the best choice. On the other hand, if you are lubricating very large cutting tools or using the system for something other than MQL and need a lot of fluid, then use the higher output version. Well, that seems pretty simple. It really is. Now, when looking at an existing system, you'll need to identify the type of pumps you have to determine the need to upgrade to new MV pumps. You can identify the Unis pumps in this simple way. If the pump body is red, then it is the older, low viscosity red pump. These have been discontinued, although repair parts are still available. If the body is black, then it is a standard pump or an MV pump. If the adjustment knob is a knurled brass, then it is a standard style. If the adjustment knob is black anodized aluminum, then it is the new MV pump. Now if there's a red cap on the end of a standard or red pump, then it is identified as a one drop pump. If the cap is black, it is a three drop pump. Now if there is a green band on the MV pump adjustment knob, it is a one drop pump. And if there is a red band, it is a two drop pump. So Larry, what are the next steps after you've identified the pump? Well, if you're using uh, standard pumps today, John, you can continue using them, or you may upgrade or change over to the new MV pumps. They're completely interchangeable. If you're using older red low viscosity pumps, then you'll need to replace the entire pump stack, including the air manifolds, with an equivalent MV pump stack. Contact us and we'll work together with you to make this as simple and as inexpensive as possible. So Larry, what else should we know about the MV pumps? Well, the general operation concept and adjustability is the same. The new knob makes adjustment more precise with detents and easy to read markings. 
One noticeable difference is that turning the knob clockwise decreases the pump output. This is the opposite of the standard pump and the red pump, so it is important to be aware of this. So Larry, do the new MV pumps offer the same warranty as the existing pumps? Uh, they do, John. The, the new MV pumps offer the same great reliability and long service life you've come to expect from Unist. They're built with the same durable materials and they feature the same standard one-year warranty as all of our Unimax pumps. Better yet, if they're used exclusively with Coolube, then they're guaranteed forever. And viewers can get more information by contacting Unist or on our website at unist.com. Thank you.